Hi everyone! In this video, I'll be showing you how to make these super cute Minnie Mouse ears for your doll. And it would be perfect to make these if you're going to Disneyland or Disney World. And this summer I actually am going to Disney World, so I decided to make a pair of these Minnie Mouse ears for Amber since I'm bringing Amber with me. So let's get on to the video! The first thing I'm going to do is make the ears. I already made a template for the ears and the circle is six centimeters wide. So now I'm going to trace it onto the black felt with Taylor's chalk. And I'm going to do it another time for the back of the ear. Now do that two more times for the other ear. Once you are done all four circles, you can cut them out. So once you are done cutting out the four circles, you are going to cut out two more using the cardboard. And it should be about half a centimeter smaller than the black circles. And my cardboard is from yogurt packaging, and you can use any kind of cardboard you have around the house, like from a cereal box or granola bars, anything that you have. So let's go! So first I am just tracing the black circle on the cardboard. And the reason why I am adding in the cardboard is so the ears are more stiff and they will go in between two of the black ears. So once you traced it, now you are just going to make it a bit smaller. So just draw another circle inside it a bit smaller. And now, cut out the small circle. Now do it one more time. Now I'm going to use a glue gun to attach this piece of cardboard to one of the black circles. And then I'm going to also use the glue gun to glue the outer edge of the circle. And then attach the other black circle. And if you are a younger child, I recommend having an adult's help with this part because the glue gun is very hot. Now while you're letting that dry, you're going to do the exact same thing for the other ear. So once you're done the two ears, we are going to make the bow. So for the bow, you will need a piece of red felt, which is about 8 centimeters by 14.5 centimeters. And it doesn't have to be that exact length. It depends if you want the bow to be bigger or smaller. And then you will also need a strip of red felt for the part of the bow that wraps around the middle. So first, you're going to fold each of these sides into the center and then glue them down. So I am just putting a line of glue here. And then glue it down. And then do it to the other side. Just press it down. Now I'm going to fold the top and bottom into the center as well. And try to make it as even as you can. Okay. 
Now flip it over and pinch the center of the bow. And in the little dent right there, put a tiny dot of glue so it stays. And finally, to finish it off, get the strip of felt and then wrap it around the bow and just glue it at the back. And then you're done the bow. For the headband, I have this black elastic, and it is about 35 centimeters long. And I'll be sewing the two ends together like this. So I have my needle and the black thread here, and I measured the elastic on my doll's head, so I'm going to sew it right here. Now I'm just cutting off this extra elastic. So I put the headband on amber and I'm going to glue the bow and both of the ears on. But first, to make sure that the glue doesn't get on her hair, I am putting this piece of paper underneath the headband. So first I'm going to attach the bow, so I'm going to put a bit of glue on the top of her head in the center. Now I'm going to attach the bow. Now I'm going to glue on the ears, so I'll be putting them here and here. So I'm going to put a bit of glue behind here and on the back of the bow a bit. And put it right here. And now do the same thing for the other ear. So I finished gluing, and now I'm just going to take the piece of paper out. So here is the final look of the Minnie Mouse ears, and I really liked how they turned out. Amber will definitely be wearing these to Disney World. So I hope you guys will try these out too, and thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. Bye!